Hi, I'm Rachel and welcome back to my channel, Bales 1986SW. And today is Friday, so it is our Friday fan. Ba -da -da -da. Boom. Um, so, let's get straight into it. I haven't got much this time round, um, but I think I found some little gems. Just a disclaimer, anything I do say, please double check on the app or the calculator. I can get sins wrong and the app likes to update itself on a regular basis and it's there to protect your weight loss. I am full of cold, so if I cough or anything like that or my throat goes a bit funny, then you know why. Um, we're just going to go with this. Um, so, <coughs> perfect example. The first thing I want to talk about are these. These, ooh, can't wait to eat these. These are by Pears um, Chocolate Apples. These were from a Tesco's. They were two for one pound fifty, I would say, or two for two pounds. I can't remember. Um, I've put these through the app, and they come out at. But it says Pears Chocolate Apple Eight Sins. Now, this one. And this one are completely different because these have all mini marshmallows on and this one has like a few little sprinkles so i don't think that's worth eight cents i think this is worth more than eight cents um i do personally think this is more eight and a half cents and this is more like your eight cents kind of thing um but on the app it just say pears chocolate decorated apple eight cents but there's a lot of mini marshmallows on there for the same synage as this one, which has just got a little bit of sprinkles on. But you will have to do what you think, but I will be sending this for eight and a half sins, and I'll be singing this for eight. Now, you might be thinking that's a hell of a lot of sins to sin for something like this, but this will make me very happy. It will make me feel really good when I go and watch the bonfire displays. I love things like this, and yeah, and the from Tesco's, and they look really, really pretty because they're pink, and you can get toffee coffee one things like that but you've got to check the app for the sins um then <coughs> sticking with bonfire night i found these in asda they are the jo joseph dobson and sons 10 mega lollies one um, pound 50 for 10 and um, i have put this through the app and it just basically it goes uh, uh, i don't think so um i haven't run it through the calculator i'll be honest but what i have done to protect my weight loss is these, these in a sweet form are two sins, um, so I'm classing these as two and a half just to protect my weight loss. Um, and I, I love this, love things like that. Um, so I've got some of those. And also in a shop called One Stop, which is owned by Tesco, so you might find this in Tesco's, this is the um, Retro Sweet Tub. This should have been £5, reduced to £2.50. And inside you get some lovely, lovely little treats. The range in sins, you've got about between four and a half to five, um, six, I think they're six, four, four, four and a half for a dib dab. Then you've got some mini whams, which are two sins. You've got some blackjacks, which are two sins. You have a fruit salad, which is two sins. And then you have a full-size packet of refreshers, which I think are six sins. Please don't quote me on any of that. But for £2.50, I thought you'd get a lot, um, a lot in it. And um, I thought it was a perfect bargain. Um, things like this, I will never um, ha eat the full bag. But something like this will look lovely on a treat bowl, just sprinkled on top. I have got a video coming up with all my treat balls ideas. It is coming. It, it, you're going to see it within Vlogmas. Um, so yeah, the shrimps and bananas and you get a jolly mixture and you get um, the cola bottles as well. So I like that because of all individually portioned. Um, of £2.50 I thought that's good. And also you do, you do get a bit more in. But my hubster and my little boy has um, eaten some of it. So there's that. Sticking with like Halloween things, um, Cadbury's have brought out spooky cake bars, toffee, screaming toffee, I think it's called, tempting toffee. Um, these are six sins are um, bar. Um, I have been loving these um, chopped up on a top of treat bowls. So basically a tub of quark, um, I just sweeten it a little bit with sweet freedom syrup, mix it all in. I've put um, chopped apple on there. Then I've got the Clark's, um, 
caramel sauce um, and thin that for two sins per tablespoon and then chopped up one of these all over it like that sprinkled that on top put the um, caramel sauce on and I've made it into a, um, a toffee apple treat bowl and it is very 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 yummy indeed so I've been loving those then sticking it with caramel um, caramel I always want to call it caramel Cadbury's Cadbury's have bought out dark milk now I'm not a fan of dark chocolate I am a milk chocolate kind of girl but because it's my favorite brand Cadbury's I thought I'm just gonna try it and see what it is and um, this is the roasted almond one and um, you'll have three pieces of this for four sins which is slightly high on sins but I've had a piece of it and yes it is dark chocolate but to me it doesn't have that bitterness to it and I have had a piece of it and I've sucked it and sucked it and sucked it and I've classed it as one and a half sins it's it's not something I'm going to repurchase but if I fancy like a sweet fix and I'm like on my higher end of my sins then yeah it will come in ideal um so I got that and it was a pound as well they do it in two varieties they do dark milk just in a plain bar and then they do dark milk with the roasted almonds and um, I got this from one stop which is owned by Tesco's and it was a pound a bar and um, that then back to a bonfire night themed in um, these are the mystic Kipling um, chocolate and marshmallow cakes Um one of these is six sins this is what they look like it's a chocolate cake with um, melted marshmallow on top in, in the middle and on top with a little bit of chocolate one of these is six sins i got suckered in because it has bonfire themed wrap it, um, packaging and i am honestly a sucker for anything what it packaging wise i just love it and um, so for six sins these once again i've used them as a treat bowl and um, i've chopped all this up on top of quark with speed which is like strawberries and raspberries and um, chopped it up on top and then i've sinned some mini marshmallows and put it all on um, and it is very very nice so there's them and you get six in a pack and they were from Asda. Then, going to back, going to Sainsbury's, I have been loving these. These are the mini cheddar ch cheese twists. One of these is half a sin. Um, I have been loving this because I've been really, really enjoying um, the fake Heinz tomato soup, Slimming World style, um, and these have been ideal just to dip in or to crumble up and put it on top, it's like a crouton thing. And for half a sin, they're fantastic, so you can have four of these for two sins. They do sell them in the long sticks as well, which are one and a half sins, but for me, me having four little mini ones makes me feel like I'm having more, so I feel like um, I'm, I'm being naughty than just having one big stick. I know you could chop it up, but it's a cheese straw and it'd just be really messy. Um, but these are really nice because like tomato soup with like a cheesy flavour, hell yes, that is delicious. Um, and these were £1.25 from Sainsbury's. And also in Sainsbury's, if you like this kind of savoury thing, especially coming up to um, Christmas, they have um, a midi... A midi cheddar cheese twist selection box where these are and you get like salted um breadsticks you get these you get them in the bigger form and then also you get a cheese and chive twist and they're all between half a sin to two sins depending on what you want um and that was one pound 70 so i thought that was amazing especially at christmas time so yeah love, i've been loving those <coughs> do apologize about my cough then in Tesco's, um, I saw these. Now, as I said, I am a sucker for packaging. These are the Fanta Zero Sugar Blood Orange. You get 250 mils in one of these, and it is like a little pumpkin, and they are so cute. Um, and these are free on the plan. You get a six in here for two pounds. Yes, the price point is slightly high, but they have been really, really cute and lovely, and they're amazing just sticking a handbag. Um, I just love them. I think they're cute. Um, yeah. So I love them. Then um, sticking with Tesco's, I um, picked up um, the creepy gingerbread biscuits. One of these is two sins, um, and they are an orange um, pumpkin um, gingerbread. They are really really nice. I've been popping one of these on a treat bowl. I love these, and for two sins, I think they're worth it. And also as well, it's that really nice soft gingerbread, so it's not going to break your teeth. Um, kind of thing and you get eight in a pack and I think they were £1.50 a pack please don't quote me on prices um, but they're really, really nice <coughs> 
And the other thing I've been loving, and I mean loving, I've only got three of these left, um, are the um, milk chocolate popping candy clusters. These are two, between two and two and a half sins, um, and you get a, quite a lot for it. Once again, I've put it on a treat bowl. I've chopped this up finely. I've just been cutting it on a treat bowl um, and called it a trick or treat treat bowl because once you put this in your mouth, you think, oh, this is lovely. And then all of a sudden, you get a popping candy um, tr trick um, and the love letter for two and a half sins. I think they're well worth it. Um, Cabras, going on to Cabras, just to do a comparison is I bought these from Asda, the 15 cornflake cluster bites. And I'll be honest, I'd rather have eight, which I absolutely love, than buy these for two pounds from Asda. These work out at two two and a half sins, I think. Oh, is it gonna fall out? Two and a half sins. Um, and you don't get a lot compared to one of these. So Asda, two pound for two and a half sins, but you do get 15, or you get eight for one pounds 50. But to me, and you know how much I love Cadbury's, but I do prefer Tesco's in this instant. Then, home bargains. I love risins. That's how I call them. I may be getting it wrong, but I've always called them risins. One of these sweets is two sins. So one little sweet is two sins. You might be thinking that's a lot of sins for one for one sweet. But these have been amazing when I'm walking to school um, for afternoon pickup for the kids, just to put one of these in my mouth and to suck it, and then it gives me that sweet fix, because that's the time of day where, just before I pick the kids up where I'm craving sugar, so one of these for two sins, just keeps me on track until my tea, and then once I've got the kids in bed, I can have my treats, um, and I've been loving them, but this is me, but I won't be having, I won't buy, I cannot buy the bag of it, because I can't, because it's too much temptation, but I've been loving these from uh, Home Bag is 29p. One little sweet is two sins, and I've been loving those. Then I popped into Boots because I needed um, a, a pick me up snack. Once again, it was that time where I needed a sugar fix. And I went and got a Shapers Blueberry Yogurt Nugget Bar. This is four sins, I think. Um, if my memory serves me right, please double check. Um, this was delicious, really nice. Um, I didn't want it to end. Um, and I thought I'd just show you. So if you do feel like you need a sweet fix, then Boots have a brilliant range called Shapers and they had so much choice as well. Um, but I chose the blueberry and yogurt and I really, really like them. So if I'm ever in a Boots again, um, quite late, on the higher price, 85p, because these are 85p and then you can see like a Cadbury's Mars, not a Cadbury's Mars bar, a Cadbury's bar for like 65p, you think. But I was good and I got one of them um, and they were really nice. Um, if you've got a Jack Fulton's, they have these on offer for, for a pound. I've eaten already the cranberry and raspberry muesli bar. These taste really, really naughty. They're four and a half since a bar and I love them and they do them in the lime muesli bar. Also as well, they do them in the apricot as well, but I just got the lime and the raspberry and cranberry. And these taste like... Um, a special K, special moments kind of bar. Um, just really naughty, something you should be having. Um, but for four and a half sins, it's a pick me up when I need it. And I absolutely have been loving these. So Jack Fulton, four for a pound and four and a half sins. Then we go to Asda. <coughs> I've been raving about these. These are the Dairy Milk Caramel uh, Mini Cookies for three sins. And I love these. Um, yes, I've been using these as a little sandwich, so I've been sinning some Walls Light Vanilla Ice Cream, putting it on top, but before I do that, I just put these in the um, microwave for about 10 seconds so they're a bit warm, and then put the little ice cream on there and make a really naughty, it, it, I think it's, I sin the ice cream for two, so it's eight sins worth of that, like that, on top of some quark with all my strawberries and raspberries to get my speed in, and it's very, very delicious. And also, they're really, really nice and they're a really good size for three sins, just with a coffee on an evening or whenever you need that, pick me up. Um, these were two sins and you do get 16 in them and the sell-by date is quite long. I've had these last week. I saw them on Saturday um, and the date runs out until Halloween. So the, the sell-by date is really good. Um, they also had the flapjacks. I've not tried these yet. Um, these are three and a half sins. And then, like I've showed you before, they have the um, cluster bites. I will not be repurchasing these. Um, 
I do prefer Tesco's and I don't often shop at a Tesco's but I, I won't be buying them again but these will be a repurchase because these are delicious then Jack Fulton's again have Smith's variety pack four snaps six chip sticks and six frazzles these are like childhood crisps crisps for me um i think they're three and a half and i think they're four and a half sins a bag them two are four and a half sins a bag the whole bag for 16 was one pound 60 which i didn't think was bad and it gives me a bit of variety in them because normally i buy just snaps and then sometimes you can just get a little bit bored of it so me giving a bit of more variety in my crisps um it helps me and for one pound 60 i was like win-win then my favorite crisps of all time especially at this time of the year are the kettles um bacon and maple syrup they're like very very naughty but very very nice so i am wanting to find an alternative to them and i think i found them these are the pop chris ridges and um, smoky bacon one packet of these is five sins i know highly sinned for a packet of crisps but it tastes quite similar to the kettles bacon and maple syrup and five sins and it's portion control it'll keep me on track and it gives me a little bit of naughtiness um, what I like and I absolutely love those that is everything I find found for Friday find so I hope you've enjoyed this as always food optimized sending positive thoughts Rachel